better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pout, I'm telling you why. Cause I'm uploading my Christmas haul in January. Eee. Side note, I didn't know if it was appropriate to use Christmas music in this video because it's January, but I'm doing it anyways because it didn't feel right without it. So don't, don't, just don't, don't come for me. Okay, enjoy. So, see, I am late. Um, what's new? <laughs> We're just gonna ignore it. I'm gonna do a Christmas haul because I know that you all still wanna see. Actually, I asked on my story if anyone was still wanting to see because I really debated putting this video up because I was like, do people still care? Turns out people apparently do still care. We'll see how this goes. So, who wants to see what I got for Christmas? Yeah, all right. I'm not even gonna do the usual disclaimer like, I am not trying to brag. I'm so grateful for everything I, cause I do it every single year and I think you get the point. I don't think anyone's trying to brag, okay? I just think everyone's just trying to show you what they got for Christmas. I really think it's an innocent gesture. So if we can just move past that, that would be great. Cause I think we're all grateful around here. Maybe not all of us, but I am. So I'm gonna show you what I got for Christmas. We're gonna start off with my stocking. First thing in my stocking are these little magnets. They've got flowers on them and stuff and cute little inspirational quotes. The next thing in my stocking is very ironic. If you've been with me for a while, since I was a little tyke, you would know that I used to collect these little things called squishies. And basically what they are, are, I don't know how to explain. I mean, it's just a little squishy thing. And I I don't know what the point of it is. They're just cute. And I used to order like ridiculous amounts of them when I was like 11 and I thought they were just it. I thought they were like the thing. And um, my mom thought it'd be funny to give me some in 2018 at the age of 18. And I'm way too happy about it. So I got this um cat burger. I'm five years old. I got another one. This one is some freaking french fries. So and then I got a Reese's peanut butter cup snowman, but I ate half of it. Then I got a little shower cap and like twisty turby towel set. Then we got some tweezers to pluck my freaking hairy eyebrows that I never get done. Then I got this thing and I had no idea what this was at first, but it's a little like weight thing that you put on your like laptop charger and it holds it down on like your desk and it's rose gold. And then I got this little Mario Badescu, Ma Mario Badescu, Badescu, but Mario Badescu little um, must have set. It comes with some hand cream, some body cream, lip balm, and some rose water spray. And I live off of rose water spray because it makes me feel like I care about myself when I spray two little sprays of rose water spray on my face. It's self care. Got some face masks, another form of self care that makes you feel like you're doing something good for yourself. Then I got some gum. Then I got a notepad. Then I got, this is, this is interesting. If you've never heard of these, they're these little like makeup bag thing. They like open up like this. So you can like see all your makeup. They're called like makeup junkie bags or some. Yeah, I got a little mini one. So this is good for travel purposes. Then I got a 10 piece cosmetic brush and manicure set. Almost done, I swear. Oh, I forgot I had these. Idiot. Huh, I was looking for like silver earrings the other day and I just, okay. Anyway, got some little mini hoop type earrings from Urban Outfitters. I got a notebook. I got this little like cinema box light type of thing, but it's a calendar and I haven't updated it since New Year's day, but that's fine. <laughs> I'm doing well. Okay, and then the last two stocking <laughs> things. I got this hedgehog. I didn't know what this was at first, but it's a little hedgehog, okay? Okay, and it has little pins in it. So you can pin your like post-it notes and Polaroids and important things. It's a cork board, hedgehog. That's the word I was looking for. <laughs> last thing is Bob Ross, a journal. Don't know if you guys remember in my last vlog, but I literally showed this exact journal. And then if you watched it, you know where I like go outside and I'm like, my mom kicked me out of Urban Outfitters because she's gonna buy me something in there for Christmas or something. She went back in there and bought it for me. So she thinks she's funny. Okay, now on to actual not stocking stuffer thing. The first thing, I'm gonna keep it on a Bob Ross theme. I got this Bob Ross mug. I know it might seem weird that it's just a mug. It's like plain black with Bob Ross on. On it um it looks like just a mug right but bob ross would not let me down that easy bob ross would not give me just a mug so it looks like just a black mug but then when you pour something in it so it paints itself when hot stuff is poured into it is that not so cool so i'm gonna get hot water and i'm gonna show you what this does oh <gasps> wait oh my god bob 
Y'all, that's so fun. Oh my God, I love Bob. So the next thing I got is this celestial projector. It's like a little projector and it projects like stars and moons and stuff on your walls and in your room. Wow. 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 So cool. And then I got a little wireless phone charger thing. It's like a little charging pad and you like lay your phone on it and it like charges your phone. Then I got some wireless earbuds, but guess what? They're not AirPods. And that's because I am not like other girls. I don't get AirPods, okay? Everyone is raving about AirPods. Everyone is making memes about AirPods. I've seen memes of AirPods stuck down in Barbie shoes. I just don't get the hype. Apple, if you're trying to sponsor me, I will hype it up, but like, if not, I'm not bougie. I'm not trying to walk around and be like flexing my AirPods. So instead I got Beats wireless earbuds. I don't need AirPods to be happy, okay? Universe, get over it. So I got some wireless earbuds, so. Then I got some of this Burberry Brit perfume. And if you know me, you know I love perfume and I like to take baths in perfume and wear way too much of it. Then I got this board game. It's called Weird Things Humans Search For. And I don't know if you guys have ever seen those videos where they have like celebrities sit down and they like peel off the little things on the board of like the what's most Googled about them. It's kind of like that or like this on the front. My cat wants to kill me, so. This is fun. Then I got a Rex Orange County vinyl because I am a aesthetic little teen white girl. To go along with the aesthetic basic teenage white girl theme, I got a little Polaroid camera. It's a Polaroid snap or something. It's not like this kind of Polaroid camera because I have this one too. This one is like a digital type one so it prints it like immediately and it's not like film. It's like an actual picture if that makes sense. The next thing I got is this necklace. It's a Kendra Scott necklace. If you don't know what Kendra Scott is, it is a brand of jewelry. And this woman in like Texas started it off and it was like some small thing and then it got like super big. Anyway, it's like kind of iridescent, if that makes sense. I don't think the camera does it justice, but it's really pretty. The next thing is an essential oil. The next thing, <laughs> the next thing is an essential oil. The next thing is an essential oil diffuser. This one is very skinny and skinny as in like skinny legend. It plays music like relaxing like nail salon spa music and it uh, diffuses essential oils. Not like that's what it's meant to do or anything. And on top of all of that, it changes colors and it has a Bluetooth speaker. That's pretty freaking cool. Okay, next, I got something that I've wanted to buy for a very long time, but just never ended up doing. I got some wildflower cases. What teenage YouTuber doesn't have a wildflower case at this point? I thought I would hop on the trend. I got this little cherry one, super cute, love it. And then I got this one. I'm hiding my pop socket because it's a gift from someone else that I'm gonna show you later. So you don't get to see it yet. It's the, like the yellow plaid one and that's the one that's on my phone. Then I got a little letter board and I've wanted one of these for a really long time. I'm not sure I'm gonna put it yet, but I like it and it's really cute. And this one has little like lights around it. And then I got this photo clip grid and it has lights around it. We got this so I could like clip my Polaroids on it. And the next thing is another thing for my room. It is this. And what this is, you might be wondering, is it's supposed to be a candle holder that you like hang from the ceiling. But we had this genius idea that we will, instead of making this a candle holder, we'll just put like fake plant because we all know I'm not gonna have a real plant. I'll kill it. So we'll put a fake plant coming out from the center of this and have it like draping down like a, like a vine type of fake plant that like drapes up. It's, I have a vision, okay? It's going to look really cute. You'll see it in my room tour, which is gonna happen soon. It's okay, and the next stuff is um, the the um, uh, the uh, the um, fangirl jumping out. As you all know, I watched The Walking Dead. I don't know if I've made that obvious. And as you all know, I might a little bit like Lauren Cohan. I mean, she's all right, I guess, you know. So, you know what? This is my life. I don't have a problem with it and neither should you because I'm who I am. And no one cares about anything I'm saying right now. They just want to know what I got for Christmas. I don't know why I go on these long rants. So first thing is a mug and it has all these little things on it that if you watch The Walking Dead, you would probably understand, but like, I'm not going to explain it. So the next thing I got, it's a sweatshirt. It has a quote from the show on it. And then I have a little notebook with the same quote on it, but this one is just black and white and it looks really cute on my desk. I got a clock, not just any clock. It's a walking dead clock. 
you know, I feel like when people buy like merchandise from like a show, it's not a clock, it's like a shirt. And so I'm trying to step out and be unique here with my Walking Dead clock. You thought it was over there? Well, you're wrong. The Walking Dead released these like jackets and the, I'm gonna explain this first because this is probably confusing to someone who doesn't watch the show. In The Walking Dead, there's like different communities where people like live, okay? And there's like four main communities. So they made jackets and on the back, they put like a patch that said the community. So I got one for Christmas. Plus it's Hilltop, which is Maggie, which is Lauren Cohan's community. Isn't that cool? This is like my favorite thing. You might think that's ridiculous, but it's literally like my favorite thing. And then I got another jacket. I got one of these fluffy jackets that everybody has, but I really like them and they're really cute. I would straighten my legs more and make this more graceful, but I'm not flexible, so this is what you get. So, one of my biggest things I got for Christmas was, I got a desk because I got a desk. I don't have an explanation. I can use this desk for desk things. I got a desk. We know! I'm gonna not even go into a dissertation that no one needs to hear. You already did, sis. And finally, I got new bedding, but I'm not gonna show you too much of it because I'm gonna save it for my room tour coming soon. But it's really cute and I love it. But you don't get to see the whole thing because I'm secretive. And then from my gammy on my mom's side, I got my favorite perfume of all time, Guess Girl. I recommend it. And then I got Dunkin' Donuts gift cards. This is golden. And then she got me some makeup brushes, a little manicure set. And she got me this. It's like a really thick headband. I'm gonna try and show you. It keeps your hair out of your way when you're like washing your face and stuff. And then she got me some Christmas socks, which I love Christmas socks. And this little Christmas notepad. And then she got me this little reindeer pin. And it's so freaking cute. So thank you, Gammy, for all the great gifts. And then from my Aunt Lish, she got me a Mac DeMarco record, vinyl, whatever you want to call it. And then she got me a game. She got me Detroit Become Human, which is a game I've actually wanted to play for a very long time. So I'm very excited to play this. Thank you, Aunt Lish. And then from my cousin Haley, we all do a secret Santa thing. So we like draw a name of somebody and we like get a gift for that person. My cousin Haley had me and she got me this really cute shirt. It's like, it's like off the shoulder and I really like it. And I like, I'm actually really excited to wear this with like high-waisted jeans or like a denim skirt or something. And then she got me a freaking Morphe palette. It's like my favorite eyeshadow colors because the only eyeshadow colors I ever wear are like these kinds of like orangey red colors. Cause I just think they like look good on the ear. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think they do. Got me this really freaking cute necklace. It's like rose gold with little white gem things and it's super cute. And now from my best friend, Brooke, because if you guys didn't know, she spent Christmas actually at my house. So the first thing is this little Polaroid snow globe. I had this idea that since she was here on Christmas, I could put like Christmassy Polaroids of us in here. And then every Christmas I could get it out and I could decorate with it and just have these memories and it'd just be super cute. And then she got me some Walking Dead socks because why wouldn't I need Walking Dead socks? So there's like three different ones. She got me a little picture frame for Polaroids. She got me two games. So she got me Life is Strange, which is a game I've wanted to play for quite a while. And she got me this game called Dying Light, which is like a post-apocalyptic game because we all know how I feel about post-apocalyptic things. She got me a freaking Rick Grimes shirt because who doesn't love Rick? Then she got me some Walking Dead little action figure things. She got me a little Maggie because she, she, th she thought I needed this and she was absolutely absolutely right. I love this more than most things in this world. And she also got me Michonne because Maggie needed a friend. There's a funny story behind this one. So this is Negan and Glenn. So if you know me, you know I'm not, you know I'm not, you know I'm not a fan of Negan. We have some beef, we have some unresolved problems. She bought it because the Glenn in here, because I love Glenn, the Glenn in here came with the little pocket watch that Glenn had in the show. And she was like, I thought you needed it. That's the story behind this gift. So.
Good intentions, good intentions. And continuing on the whole Walking Dead thing, she got me a Rick cup. And then she got me, this is a little wrinkled because I wore it, but she got me this Walking Dead shirt. This is Herschel's farm. Okay, so I'm smart and forgot to film this clip because it was on my phone and not like in the pile of stuff I was showing. But another thing Brooke got me was this pop socket, which I mentioned briefly earlier. And the pop socket has a picture of me and Lauren Cohan on it. She also got me a necklace, but I'm wearing it. It's a little Zodiac necklace and I have a funny story. So this is a cancer zodiac little astrology sign thing necklace. It's really funny because I'm not a cancer. I'm a Leo technically, but you know all those like zodiac posts that are everywhere. They never fit me the Leo ones, but the cancer one always fits me and my birthday is actually the day that like the cancer zodiac sign ends and the Leo one starts. So I always say that I'm like technically a Leo, but I feel like I'm more of a cancer because it makes more sense for me. So she bought the cancer one because we always joke about how I'm not really a Leo and then she bought it and I laughed so hard because she would do that So that is everything Brooke got me. She literally spoiled me. I'm going to have to fight her I don't deserve this, but I love her. Okay guys. So that is everything that I got for Christmas I hope you enjoyed seeing what I got. I'm very grateful for everything I got and I Have the greatest family and friends. I have not done my like outro in such a long time So I'm gonna do it for old time's sake not really old time's sake I'm just I haven't done it because I've either forgotten or forgotten Forgotten. If you liked this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you like Christmas, give it a big thumbs up. If you don't like Christmas or don't celebrate Christmas, give it a big thumbs up. If you love me, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the little post notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. Follow me on Instagram at Kaylin's Gaming and on Twitter at official Kaylin. I'm going to try to get back on track with uploading. I'm making it my 2019 New Year's resolution to upload more free frequently and consistently, so don't kill me yet. I love you all, have a great day, bye. <laughs>